How to choose a best tripod Here are 5 best characteristics. There are a few crucial factors to address when selecting the proper tripod for your camera, shooting style, and skill level. Aside from sturdiness, setup speed is vital, not all subjects will wait for you to set up your tripod, so consider quick release grips over rubber twist leg locks if weather and animals are important to you. Carbon fiber tripods are lighter, but more expensive, and the more leg pieces you have, the smaller it will fold, but the longer it will take to put up. Here's a comprehensive list of 5 best considerations to aid you in making the best decision. Number 1. Carbon fiber versus aluminum. These are the two most used tripod leg materials. Aluminum tripods are less expensive, but they are heavier. They're perfect if you want your money to be as stable as possible. Carbon fiber tripods are more expensive, but they are lighter and absorb vibration better. They're useful if weight is more essential than cost, although the price difference might be significant. Number 2 Sections of the Legs and Leg Restraints Legs for tripods may be divided into 3, 4, or 5 parts. When folded, a tripod with a higher number of parts is shorter and more portable, but it may take a bit longer to put up and may not be as sturdy. Twist locks and flip locks are the two most common varieties. Twist locks take up less space and are often easier to operate, while putting up the tripod, you can frequently open all of the leg pieces in a single motion. Flip locks are separately controlled and may be a little slower. To find out which you prefer, try both kinds. Number 3 Types of Heads The tripod head is sometimes included, and sometimes it isn't. Depending on how you want to work, you may swap out one head for another. The most frequent forms are ball heads and three-way heads. Ball heads are tiny and fast to operate, but they're not ideal for small, precise motions. Three-way heads are bigger, but they let you fine-tune each axis separately. Other, more specialized heads may also be found. Fine modifications to camera angles are possible with geared heads. Gimbal heads are intended for use with long, heavy lenses that might otherwise throw a tripod off balance. There are also professional heads for panoramas and video. Number 4 Length when folded, height minimum and maximum and column in the middle. If you're planning to transport a tripod over a long distance, its weight is significant, but so is its folded length. It will put you off carrying it anywhere if it is too lengthy to attach to your luggage and is awkward on trains or while climbing over stiles. Many travel tripods include legs that fold up and fully surround the head for storage. When folded, they are smaller and neater, making them simpler to carry. It's not always better to shoot at eye level, but it's also important to find a comfortable working height. If possible, measure the height without the column extended. Although not all tripods have a central column, the majority do. You may stretch this higher to raise the camera's height, but this will add further wobbling. The center column of certain tripods may be tilted to create an angled boom, which is ideal for overhead pictures, macro photography, and tabletop photography. Using the center column reduces the tripod's stability, therefore it's best avoided while shooting long exposures. Number 5 Angles of Legs Different Types of Foot Most tripods feature independently angled legs, which is very beneficial while working on sloping terrain or in tight spaces. For everyday usage, the typical leg angle will suffice, although splaying one or more legs outwards on uneven terrain or resting them against walls, for example, is often beneficial. If you spread out all three legs, you'll be able to shoot from a considerably lower angle. Rubber feet work well on most surfaces, but they're especially good on carpets and hardwood floors when you don't want to scratch them. Metal spikes are ideal for soft, uneven terrain. And lastly the rubber feet of certain tripods may be screwed back to expose spikes. Thanks for watching and subscribe the channel for more.